Iran appears to be equipped with a new advanced laser defense system, according to a picture posted on the X account of MediH on October 4, 2024. Initial analyses suggest that this laser system could be the China-made Shennong Shield 3000 and 5000 laser defense system, also known as the Silent Hunter. This sighting indicates that Iran may have acquired this state-of-the-art technology to enhance its defensive capabilities against low-altitude threats. The system spotted is a low-altitude laser defense system, characterized by its ability to target and neutralize unmanned aerial vehicles UAVs and other low-flying objects. The Silent Hunter variant is an electrically powered, fiber-optic laser weapon system developed by China. It boasts a power output ranging between 30 and 100 kilowatts, allowing it to effectively engage targets at various ranges and altitudes. One of the remarkable features of the Silent Hunter is its maximum operational range of 4 kilometers. At a distance of 800 meters, it is capable of penetrating 10 millimeters of steel, demonstrating its potency against armored targets. This capability makes it a significant asset for countering drone swarms and protecting critical infrastructure from aerial threats. Recent defense ties between Iran and China reflect a deepening strategic partnership, underscored by a comprehensive 25-year cooperation agreement signed in 2021. This deal, intended to boost Iran's military and technological capacities, includes joint military training, intelligence sharing, and potentially significant arms transfers. The agreement allows China to use Iranian air and naval facilities, especially in the Persian Gulf, which strengthens both nations' positions in the region amid shifting geopolitical alliances. China's defense collaborations have included technology transfers and training aimed at enhancing Iran's anti-access and area denial capabilities, especially against aerial and maritime threats. As part of this partnership, Iran may gain access to advanced Chinese weaponry, including anti-drone systems and missile technologies. This defense alliance positions both countries as strategic counterweights to U.S. influence in the Middle East. China's Silent Hunter laser defense system, recently spotted in Tehran, exemplifies the possible arms transfers that support Iran's defensive infrastructure against low-altitude aerial threats, marking a significant step forward in bilateral military collaboration. Armed forces find laser systems highly effective against drone threats due to their precision, speed, and low operational costs. Lasers can disable or destroy drones almost instantly by targeting their sensors or structural components, making them ideal for countering swarms of small, low-flying UAVs. These systems also offer scalability in power output, allowing forces to adjust energy levels based on the target type, which is cost-efficient compared to traditional interceptive munitions. Additionally, laser systems generate minimal collateral damage and can operate continuously as long as there is sufficient power making them reliable assets in defending sensitive locations. Several armed forces worldwide are advancing laser weapon systems to counter the growing threat of drones and other aerial targets. The US military, for example, is developing the high-energy laser weapons system to neutralize UAVs and rockets, with tests showing promising results in both mobile and stationary defense settings. Similarly, Israel's Iron Beam is a high-powered laser system designed to intercept drones, mortars, and missiles at close range, supplementing the Iron Dome missile defense system. In Europe, Germany has tested its own laser systems within the Bundeswehr for similar drone defense applications. These developments aim to provide a cost-effective, precise, and responsive defense solution as drone threats evolve in complexity and scale. The introduction of such a system into Iran's arsenal could have substantial implications for regional security dynamics. It indicates a potential deepening of military cooperation between Iran and China, aligning with both nations' strategic interests. Furthermore, it enhances Iran's ability to defend its airspace against increasingly sophisticated drone incursions, which have become a common feature in modern asymmetrical warfare. The arms trade between states signifies a substantial level of trust in the quality and reliability of weapons, as well as confidence in obtaining adequate technological and service support throughout the weapons service life. China's major customers, such as Pakistan, Bangladesh, and Myanmar, exemplify these traits. However, Iran has not exhibited the same level of enthusiasm. It has been facing comprehensive US-led international sanctions since 1979 which have hindered Iran's ability to sell energy resources and procure weapons, 
thus impacting its economy and regional influence. Therefore, China could be the supplier of last resort to Iran for both general and crucial strategic weapons. It is widely recognized that China and Iran have maintained enduring and productive military ties. With the former significantly contributing weapon platforms and critical military and dual-use technologies to the Islamic Republic. However, their bilateral military relationship has encountered challenges over time. This article examines the arms sales over the past five decades, identifies broad patterns indicative of future trends, and evaluates whether the prima facie impression of China's predominant role in augmenting Iran's military capability is accurate and credible. In the past two decades, China has not significantly influenced Iran's conventional weapons inventory. Tehran has predominantly favored local or Russian options and has retained a minor manufacturing role in the aviation and defense sectors. Facing challenges in reverse engineering advanced technology-based weapons. Furthermore, Iran has not sought assistance from China in its drone production sector, where Tehran has established itself as a significant producer. Finally, although China has played a significant role in Iran's military advancement and procurement, Iran's primary power resides in its own domestic production capabilities. Despite common belief stemming from the recent Iranian strike on Israel, Iran's regional deterrence and anti-access area denial abilities may take cues from China, but are not dependent on or supplied by Beijing. China on its part, aims to avoid international isolation and has refrained from deep involvement in Iran's nuclear, biological, and chemical weapons sectors. Beijing's compliance with United Nations Resolution 1747 in 2007 led to the cessation of overt arms trade with Iran. Despite the expiration of sanctions in October 2020, there has been no credible evidence of a resurgence in Chinese arms supplies to the Islamic Republic of Iran.